What is included in Horizon Forbidden West, Burning Shores? Horizon Forbidden West Burning Shores, DLC Story It looks like the post-apocalypse that has ripped through so much of North America in Aloy's world has treated Los Angeles particularly harshly. This is where Burning Shores will be set, and it's been confirmed that in terms of the timeline it'll be a coda after the end of Forbidden West story. LA has been transformed into a volcanic archipelago, one that will be challenging and dangerous to navigate thanks to lava flows as well as its violent robotic inhabitants. She will be traveling to a dangerous new region south of the Tenek clan lands, featuring a compelling storyline following from where Horizon Forbidden West ended, new characters, adventures, and more, some details which we look forward to sharing with you very soon. We know that there will be new characters to meet and stories to uncover, but we'll have to wait until more is unveiled before we can get into any more detail. Horizon Forbidden West, Burning Shores seems to mostly feature additional story content without much else. So you'll want to pick it up if you want to continue Aloy's adventure from the base game. Neither Sony nor Guerrilla Games have revealed any other content included with the DLC. Horizon Forbidden West Burning Shores DLC Platforms The single most controversial part of what would normally be a pretty routine announcement is that Burning Shores isn't coming to both of the platforms that hosted Forbidden West. Guerrilla Games has made what it calls the difficult decision to only bring the DLC to PlayStation 5, since it apparently pushes past what the PS4 can manage technically. That means you'll need to upgrade if you played the base game on PS4, as the DLC will not be coming to your console as it stands. The Burning Shores is a mentioned-only location in Horizon Forbidden West and the playable location of Horizon Forbidden West, Burning Shores. Horizon Forbidden West Burning Shores DLC Gameplay We'd assume from what Gorilla has showed off so far that Burning Shores will basically be more of Forbidden West albeit in a new area that will presumably be smaller and more concentrated than the game's main map. LA will be open to exploration through land, water, and air on the back on Sunwing, something that's prominent in the screenshots and trailer released so far. This makes it look like it'll be a pretty dynamic playground. We're hoping to tangle with new enemy types and get our hands on some new weaponry and tools, too but all this will have to wait for full confirmation before the DLC releases. Our creative vision for The Burning Shores is an ambitious expansion which will take Aloy to the ruins of Los Angeles. It's an overgrown and fractured city that can be fully explored via the water and flying on the back of a sunwing. A massive machine threat lurks in its shadows, a huge challenge that Aloy must overcome by using all of her skills and abilities. To achieve this grand vision technically and creatively, we've made the difficult decision to focus all our efforts on making an incredible experience exclusively for the PlayStation 5 console. Horizon Forbidden West Burning Shores DLC Release Date We got a release date for Burning Shores in December 2022, when Sony and Gorilla confirmed that it's coming out on April 19, 2023. The downloadable content was unveiled at the Game Awards, Gaming's annual awards and trailer showcase.